Hey guys, welcome back to the channel Daughter of Increase. My name is Nate Denise. For those of you who are new to the channel or who just happened to stumble across this video, and I post the videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday all about my faith, God, Christ, and expanding the kingdom of God. As you can see from the title above, today, July 26th, is the two year anniversary of Daughter of Increase, and it amazes me that it's been two years um, that God has blessed me with this ministry you guys know i don't like the word ministry but um that god has blessed me with this ministry and just seeing how i'm able to grow and able to help other people grow as well and mature in their faith is really just mind-blowing um i never would have thought that i would have this type of youtube channel or blog or anything like that um i don't know so it, it just blows my mind. So today I am releasing a bunch of new products as well as some freebies. So the first thing I'm going to talk about are the freebies. Um, I was supposed to have at least 10 freebies for you guys. But as of right now, I only have four that are actually finished. And you can find those by clicking the link down below to go to Dropbox to download them. But um, yeah, so the first one is called a Heart Check Worksheet. And it's just basically like a weekly checklist that you can print out for yourself. You can either write on the actual paper or use it as like a template for your own personal journaling time. And um, it's just a bunch of questions. And I'm actually just looking at the worksheet now. But it's questions like what do you need to let go of for the week? Who do you need to forgive for the week? Um, some fears that are holding you back, who you have encouraged, how you spent time in the word, um, or how you spent time with God rather, and then what you can do the following week to be more focused and intentional with God. So it's just you taking a breather to just check your heart and make sure you're aligned with God pretty much is what that worksheet is. Um, the next printable is basically a snippet out of the book Thief of Corinth by Tessa Afshar. And my book is way over there. Let me grab it. So the next printable is actually one that is one that I typed up from this book, Thief of Corinth by Tessa Afshar. And in this book, there is a scene where um, Paul is talking to Ardene and, um, you know, they're talking about God and Ardene is sitting there listening to certain things and God is basically ministering to her. And it was absolutely phenomenal to the point where I liked it so much that I actually have a printable of it on my wall. And I, I figured, why not share it with you all? Um, and it's just, it's talking about his love. So I titled it God's Love. And um, I'll just read a portion of it. It says, my love for you is patient. I have never been impatient with you. Not by word or deed have I ever shown you any impatience. My love for you is kind. I have not spoken to you unkindly in all the years that I have known you. I have never harbored an unkind thought towards you. I have never been envious of you, never felt jealous of your abilities or passions. I am not resentful or angry when you spend time with others or show them affection. I have never spoken rudely to you. My love for you does not make selfish demands. I have never insisted that I should have my own way. My love for you is not easily angered. I have never held on to offenses you have committed against me. Indeed, I have wiped them from my ear. I'm sorry, from my ear in memory. My love for you has never given up, never lost faith, never stopped hoping for the best. I have not given into the despair or discouragement no matter what we have faced. And it says, my love will my love for you will endure through every circumstance. My love for you never fails, not even in the darkest hours. And this is literally from a scene. It was like a bunch of snippets that I literally just took the snippets and put them together to compile this. And it's something that I try to read to myself every day because it's just very powerful to me. So um, I have that available for you guys to download. The next one is a how-to Bible study printable. But this one is for those who do Bible journaling. I was supposed to have another one. That is for like how to Bible study without a journaling Bible. I'm still working on that one. <laughs> but um, literally it's nine steps and there's pictures included and little little um, notes on each step. So I have that available. That's about three pages long. And then the last printable I have is called 
um, identity in Christ and it literally just goes through different things that talks about your identity in Christ so it's like I am chosen by God I am adopted by God I am a child of God in this family I am forgiven by God of all my sins I am seen by God as holy blameless and above reproach I am sealed with God's Holy Spirit I am called to accomplish God's purpose I'm a full citizen among God's people I am sanctified set apart by God's Spirit I am justified declared right in God's sight I am redeemed brought with Christ's blood I am an ambassador of Christ. I am conformed to the character of Christ. I am free in Christ. I am victorious. I am healed. I am not forsaken. There's like a list of I am um, kind of affirmations and statements with scriptures, of course. Um, and then at the end, there is a prayer that says, thank you for loving me in spite of my falls. Thank you for your precious gift of love. Thank you for new mercies. Thank you for your grace that abounds. Thank you for the peace you give me. Thank you for restoration. Thank you, for thank you, Lord, for giving me worth. And letting me see I have purpose. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. So, just something I compiled together. Um, So, those are the only four right now. I still have a bunch of other freebies that are, like, in my brain that need to be put on the paper. So, we're going to hope I can get that together by September. But, um, those are the four freebies that I have right now available. So, if you guys are interested in any of those freebies, like I said, just click the link down below to go. And you can download one, all of them, none of them. is up to you. Um, the second thing is new shirts so you guys know i had shirts um a while ago i think earlier this year i had some shirts and um i do i still have the um daughter of increase labels for those shirts um, not labels but like the fonts for those shirts if that makes sense whatever it's called and um i like them a lot but i just i i wanted something different something bolder something that was more fashionable if that makes sense so i came up with two new shirts and I did share with you, share them with you guys on Instagram but those shirts were like test shirts and they were on gray shirts but now I have the new ones that are on like white shirts I'm only offering this in a white shirt just because I feel like a white shirt just goes with anything you can dress it up you can dress it down wear it to church if you want to wear it out on a date it doesn't matter um so yeah I have two new shirts the first one I'm wearing and it's literally my favorite shirt like favorite 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 shirt because of the rose gold glitter but um here it is it literally just says daughter of increase john 330 now when you guys get your shirt the john 330 will be smaller <laughs> um like i said i did test shirts and um i ended up making everything bigger than what it was on the gray shirt but it has two square boxes you have the rose gold glitter which is yes and then you get the black so i'm loving that so we have that and um then i have this one here which is just an overlap daughter of increase in the lavender and black um so yeah i am excited about those two shirts those shirts do range from 25 to 28 dollars that includes free shipping that includes me getting your shirts that includes me um, packaging and everything so 25 to 28 depending on your size i will leave all the information down below where you can go and purchase the shirt but um yeah like i said it includes free shipping okay so the last thing i want to release to you guys today on the anniversary are my new mugs so you guys know i already had the black ones that i originally did this one is mine and it's a test one that i kind of messed up so don't pay the o any mine but um the black one and then you guys saw on Instagram that I posted the pink one because I had my unicorn crappy in it. It was so cute. Um, but we have the pink one, which has my coffee in it for now. So good. But I told you guys I have four other colors that I was going to do. And they're done. And I'm like so excited. I actually love them all. And um, I'm proud of myself pretty much. So the first one is this yellow one. Right here. They all, literally all just say Daughter of Increase on them. Then we have this royal blue. Hope you guys can see that. We then have red because we have to have a red, right? We just have to. And the last one, I didn't think it would actually look right on this because it's a clear mug. But it actually came out really nice and it's the white one. I have pictures of all six of these mugs on Instagram so you guys can see how they look side by side. I will also have pictures of these on the blog when you go to purchase. But yeah, um, I have my mugs ready and I'm excited about all of these new releases with the two shirts and the mugs. I do plan to upgrade the mugs soon. Um, right now, this is um, permanent vinyl on here. So it is hard to take this off. However, you cannot put these in the microwave, which is the kind of part that sucks about it. So I am looking into getting some new designs that are more so printed onto the mugs 
so that it's microwave safe um, and dishwasher safe. These you do have to hand wash and um, do not keep them in hot areas for too long if that makes sense. Um, when I do get send the mugs out, there will be like a little note card with all the information about the mugs. Um, these mugs hold about 16 ounces of a drink. Um, I would even, I'm gonna say 15 on the safe side because 16 is like cutting it. You you gonna have too much spilling out. I've had too many accidents, but um, about 15 ounces so you can get a good cup of coffee in here. Um, I literally normally fill my coffees up to the top of the D. Literally, the coffee I do is about 8 ounces, it fills hair, and then I just douse creamer and syrups in here to add some more flavor, but. Really great cups. Um, these I will be selling for $30, and it might sound pricey to some people, but that includes free shipping, um, because I want to make sure that these get to you securely, and I don't want to charge you shipping for what UPS USPS will charge um, so $30 covers everything um, I do have a sale in which you can get one cup and a mug together for $40 and that would save you 15 if I'm not mistaken $15 um, all that information is on my blog I have a whole coupon code and all that down below on my blog so you guys can check that out just click the link down below um, but Yes, that is what is going on for now with that. So, on to the two-year giveaway. I have two giveaways going on. One for the men that follow me, because I do have men that actually follow me, which I am ever so grateful for. And then one for the ladies, of course. So, I'm going to start off with the men. Because I really do appreciate the men that do follow me. And, I mean, you got you guys are out there, like, commenting and giving me so many suggestions and especially on my bible reviews a lot of the men do comment and like give me their suggestions and tell, tell talk about other bibles with me which is insane so i already have the stuff in here but i'm taking it out okay so let me take this off the first thing i have for the men is this book is called overcoming life challenges lessons from the life of joseph by bill crowder and it's just a small read on joseph and um i think joseph is a good guy to study in the bible so we have that the next thing we have is a devotional you guys don't have a lot of devotionals um but this is the our daily bread devotional collection this is in the walnut navy i think it is I don't think they have the actual color name. Yes, they do. It is the Navy Walnut Edition. So it's definitely more so for men. Um, and it just is a daily devotional for the year. From Our Daily Bread. And I love Our Daily Bread devotionals. Amazing. Um, in that, I do have this In Touch Ministries um, journal. And it's just a black journal. Really nice. It literally just says In Touch Ministries. Um, it's kind of like a moleskin in a sense. But I wanted to keep it simple for men. I then have this art copy because I had so many copies of this. This art copy um, of American Omens by Travis Thrasher, The Coming Fight for Faith. And this is a, what is this? Oh my gosh. A futuristic sci-fi suspense kind of novel. And I figured this would be one that men would enjoy reading. So we have this. I have not fully read this book. I literally read the first chapter and have not gone past it. But the first chapter was really, really interesting. I, 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 I need to get up on it real soon. So I might put this in my August TBR. Hopefully. We'll see. I then have this Christian Camp and Conference Association Beyond Camp 30 Reflections from Our Daily Bread. So another kind of Devo kind of study. Um, and this one is a little bit more interactive. Um, it has readings in it. There's places for you to put your reflections. It's really nice. There's nice pictures in there. Um... This guy is, I don't even know what he's doing, but yeah, <laughs> that seems cool. And then lastly, I have this arc here, which is Rise of the Servant Kings, what the Bible says about being a man by Ken Harrison, who is the chairman of the board for Promise Keepers. So another book for men. I do have a lot of men's books, um, but sometimes I get too many arcs sent to me of the same book and I don't need them. So we have this, which I also own and have not read yet. But um, that is what I have for the men who follow me. And um, yeah, so on to what I have for the women. This one is for the women. It's all packed up already. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to end up switching the envelopes because I've had these packed for a minute. <laughs> but um, yes. So the first thing in here is this Broken Way 
um, a conversation with Ann Voskamp. Ann Voskamp, she wrote, oh my god, the book. Oh my gosh, I can't think of the book name, but I'll put the book cover here. She wrote that book, and um, it's really good, so I have this. Then we have this small kind of coffee table one. It's called Small Blessings, um, Hope and Encouragement from Our Daily Bread. And I really do like this book. I have a copy of this, and my mom does. And it's just really cute encouragements. But what makes me love it the most are, like, the cute little pictures in there. Like, uh, first of all, chocolate. Yes, sir. Um, there's other pictures of, like, sneakers on a track field. Children with Santa hats. Um, I mean a church with like I, I really just love the clouds in the back I have this thing with clouds and flowers especially like in the spring I just I love taking pictures of clouds and um, stuff so there was another picture in here that I really really liked if I can find it probably not right now but it's just a really nice um, coffee table book that I think is great to leave in your living room you have guests and they can just look this one is so cute the little girl blowing bubbles so we have this um, then we have this one from Oswald Chambers. It's an intimate look at the father, the father heart of God, the love of God by, like I said, Oswald Chambers. I have this book. My mom does too. I haven't read it yet, unfortunately. You guys know I have way too many books, so yeah. The next book I have is one that I, I love. Um, the next two, rather are ones that I love. So we have um, Running for Mercy by Anthony J. Carter. This one is a study of Jonah and oh my god this book is phenomenal. I think I did a review of this book. If I did I will leave um, a link you clicked on the I on the screen but this book here you guys was so good. I loved it so much. It just really made me love Jonah all the more so I have this copy to give away. And another book that I love you guys know. Who doesn't love Kling? Like seriously who doesn't? <laughs> Kling is like phenomenal. I love Kling so much. So Kling by Kim Cash Tate. Um, if you haven't seen my review, click the on the screen for that. I love this so much. So much. Then I have this Devo. Um, the same one that I was giving to the men. But um, it's the Beyond Camp 30 Reflections from Our Daily Bread. Devotional. Really, really cute devotional. Um, then I have three Bible studies. So this Bible study is actually six studies in one book. Um, Jesus' Blueprint for Prayer. Applying the Lord's prayer to your life by Hayden Robinson this is one that I've done so many times and then stopped doing and then redid and then stopped doing and then redid yeah I bought a new book so that I can actually sit down and thoroughly do this study so I will be doing the study myself really soon so I have a copy to give away and then the last two are also Bible studies. Um, they are from Moody Publishers. You guys know how I feel about Moody Publishers. A lot of you guys have asked me for me to do my um, review of their women's Bible study selection. I do own all of their women's Bible studies. So I will be doing that video really soon. But um, we have If God is for Us by Trillia J. Newbell. I can never pronounce the name, but I did it right. Um, it's a six-week study of Romans 8, and it's the everlasting truth of our great salvation. And I did start this. haven't finished it yet, though. If the group is still up, because I think it is, I will leave a link to the group down below where you can um, check out. She did video sessions with this. There was like a group study that she did on Facebook. It was so great. Um, like I said, I never got a chance to finish it, so I need to finish it ASAP. <laughs> so we have this. And the last one I have is Included in Christ by Heather Holman. It's an eight-week Bible study of Ephesians, Living a New Story from Ephesians. I think we did an Ephesians studies. I think we did. If I did, I'll leave a link. You click out of screen for that. <laughs> but um, Ephesians is another great book. So we have this one as well. And this one, I did like one week of it and never finished. So yeah. Last thing I am including in this giveaway for the women is this little journaling set um this is three little notebooks that i got from walmart i have a bunch of these i love them so much there were three different kinds um i don't even have mine because i separated them and they're like under the bed but um yeah they come with these three little journals and i love them so much because i'm a freelance makeup artist for those of you who don't know i love makeup i haven't worn makeup in a while on my channel but i do makeup for clientele um for bridals for photo shoots um, runway and all that so I love doing makeup and when I saw this I was just like yes um, the eyelashes holographic yes the blue notebook has like holographic lines and then this one says killing it so cute so I got these um, they are soft cover journal three packs 64 pages each so yeah they're from like I said Walmart pen and gear and I love pen and gear from Walmart amazing so um yes that's what I have so how do you enter 
it's, it's, it's gonna be simple um first thing you do is be a subscriber of my channel <laughs> um the second thing is follow me on instagram and leave your instagram name down below so that i can make sure that you're following the third thing you can do is just go to the Facebook page for Daughter Up Increase and like that page. I really am working on getting my Facebook page to 500 likes. Um, right now I'm at 360 something, if I'm at 330, 360, about that range. Um, so I really just want to get to 500, even a thousand likes by the end of the year. That's just a personal goal that I have. And um, that's the third thing. So the fourth thing is just comment down below how DOI has helped you within the past two years, um, whether you're a new subscriber or an old subscriber. Um, I just want to know how I've been helping you guys, I guess, in a sense, with your personal walk. And um, also let me know if there's anything you would like to see on the channel. I know a lot of you guys are interested in like those study with me videos. I finally got my setup correct, so those are coming really, really soon. Um, so we have those coming, but, um, if there's any other thing that you want to see on my channel, just let me know. I'm, I'm really looking to expand. I'm thinking about including more vlog style videos. I don't know. Just let me know what you guys want to see. So subscribe, um, like Instagram, leave your Instagram name down below. Go to the Facebook page, like the Facebook page. The fourth thing you do is comment down below and just tell me how DOI has, um, helped or influenced you in any way within your walk. Um, also, let me know if there's anything that you would like to see, and um, that's pretty much it. I would say please be 13 years or older. Um, if you're under 18, please make sure that you do have adult permission to enter this giveaway because I am going to need your address. And um, this is not international. I do apologize. I plan to do an international giveaway really, really soon. Um, really soon because I really I know that I do have a lot of international viewers um, and there are just some things that I definitely do want to send out to you guys because I know you guys can't get them where you live but for now this is going to be US based um, so yeah that's the giveaway for the men and the women if you're interested all the information will be down below because I know I'm talking probably a little too fast you're probably confused so all the information on how to enter is down below the links are down below to the freebies and um, as well as to where you can order the t-shirts and the mugs um, so yeah, and one more thing, a lot of people always ask me this about how they can be a blessing to um, Daughter of Increase and in sowing a seed. I don't mind people sowing a seed into the ministry. I don't look for it. Um, I don't ask for it. I know a lot of people are like always telling me I should charge for certain things, but God hasn't put it on my heart to do that yet. Um, it, you know, the only thing God has told me to do is to charge for like the Bible study notes just because I really do a lot of research and like... You know, I go in depth with my notes. So he did start telling me to charge, which is why I do charge now for those. But um, as for everything else, the, the content that I do on this channel is for you guys to grow. I mean, I didn't have this stuff when I didn't know where to start. Um, really, YouTube didn't really show me much, which is why I wanted to create this channel. Um, but yeah, if you want to be a blessing, I do have PayPal and I'll leave my PayPal email down below. But um, I don't look for people to you know ask me like people always ask me how much can I sew like if you want to sew you by all means can sew into the ministry um, all the information will be linked down below but I don't look for it if that makes sense I hope I'm making sense um, some people have sewn into the ministry and I am ever so grateful and thankful um, I don't work you guys, you, you probably know the story. I've talked about it plenty of times, but I don't work. Um, it's just not in the cards for me to work. It's not like I haven't been trying. I've been trying for years, for the past four years, four, four, four years, four years. My son is five. For the past four years, I've been looking for work. And, um, you know, it's not that I don't have a good resume. I've done real estate for six months. I've done, um, you know, I've worked with children literally all of my life. I've done clerical work. I've done tutoring. You know, I, I've done a lot. My, my, I've worked at law firms, like, I've done a lot. My resume is great. It's just God doesn't have it in the cards for me to work. And um, I've just been sustaining through him. Um, you know, he literally f provides for me every which way I turn. Um, and of course, I live at home with my family. So, you know, it is a struggle. But, um, you know, people ask me if I do this for money. No, I don't. Um, it never occurred to me to do it for money. You can get paid off of YouTube. You can get paid from different channels and um, things like that. But I do things for the love of it. And sometimes it does turn out where I can earn a little bit of cash. 
which is great. But um, a lot of the times, like, I do this stuff because I love it. It is just what it is. So, um, again, if you feel like you are being led to want to sew into the ministry, by all means, you can send me an email if you want to. Some of you have done that. Or you can just go to PayPal, type my email address in, and do it like that. I do have a donate button on my blog. Um, but, yeah, um, I guess that's it. It's been two years. Um, it's been really great. I do have, like, this long-winded post you can check out on, like, the blog if you want to about the two-year anniversary. But, um, you know, I don't want to be on this video crying. I didn't want to be on this video boohoo and all that stuff because, um, I don't think you guys understand that, um, uh, daughter of increase, I know it's been helpful for many of you, but it has helped me come out of the dark spot that I was in. Um, it has helped me mature. It has led me into my call. Um, it has helped me to prepare myself to be elevated into the um, position I'm getting ready to be elevated into in ministry. And it's amazing. Um, DOI literally has been one of those things that God has given me and that has blossomed. And I'm looking forward to seeing it continue to blossom. I have some things that I want to do. I do want to plan a girls weekend trip. Um, like a two day, three day girls weekend trip. Um, I'm going to be looking into that. And I do want to get my bishop and my pastor involved in that. I'm looking into doing a meet and greet. So, um, yeah, the first meet and greet will most likely be in New York City. <laughs> or probably New Jersey. I don't know. New York or New Jersey. Because I live in Jersey, but I'm a New Yorker at heart. So, I don't know. I'm looking to do something really intimate. Probably do like a Starbucks meet and greet. Or find like a nice cafe or something like that. Um, but that probably won't be till next year. As well as the... Um, girls weekend trip i'm really just looking into things because i know a lot of you guys like want to like meet me and um sit and just powwow about the word of god and just life in general and um for many of you you guys don't know i am 28 years old but i look like a baby i know but i'm 28 years old and a lot of you, of my viewers are older some are younger but um a lot of you guys are older and i just truly appreciate everything that you guys do as far as watching liking my videos see commenting i love listen i love comments and i love emails when you guys email and comment a lot of you guys send me like these long-winded emails and comments and be like oh my god i'm so sorry but I, I don't mind it like i am one of those people who i love interacting with people i'm a very quiet yet outgoing person if you don't know me i would seem like a very quiet person um, but I can definitely be outgoing when you really do know me. Um, I'm just, I'm, I'm a Gemini if you didn't know. So, yeah, we're going to leave it at that. <laughs> but, um, yeah, DOI has helped me tremendously in so many ways. And my brother is blasting music right now. So, I'm going to end this video. Um, if you want to enter the giveaway, enter. All the links to where you can purchase the products are going to be down below. And, um, yeah. I, I will have another shirt coming. Um, and it's going to be rose gold with some pink detailing on it because we just love rose gold. But um, I'm just really proud of everything that I've done. Um, I am thankful for you, to you guys who watch my channel, who subscribe. Like, I never would have thought I, I... I'm almost... I'm, I'm soon to be at 3,000. It would amaze me if I hit 3,000 by the end of the year, literally. Like, it would amaze me. Um, so, yeah. This is the giveaway. This is these are the new products that I have, and I hope you guys are interested in some of these or all of them or whatever. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna end this video here, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.